birthday party people we here back with another banger judgment the lost judgment we here and last time we took down old dude i forget his name already i'm terrible with these names my fault but we took the old dude who was talking well not even talking old girl he was using her and so now we came back we hope keiko we gonna get her money back, but we still gotta go lay the smack down on some of these fools. So we brought Keiko back to my dude, Genji Genda. <laughs> Genda, so Genda gonna let her stay here. And that's really all that happened. There was just a whole bunch of talk we followed Kuza. I think his name was Kuza or something like that. We followed him, we tailed him, and we smacked him. We finished him and his homies and whatever. And so now we about to go up to the actual people get her money back and we're gonna call it a, you know what i'm saying we're gonna call it a night but uh thank y'all for coming and watching this gameplay i really appreciate i really appreciate i really appreciate what y'all are doing so showing the support and so keep on coming back invite your friends invite your family don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe if you are new and don't be afraid to comment go ahead hit that comments so i can see if I'm missing something, but also just so we can communicate, just so we can talk. You can also follow me on Twitter and I'll, uh, Twitch and all that. I'll post that at the end on the end screen. But let's get into this. I'm not going to over. Speaking this, of so which, I want to get right back into this. It's getting good. I mean, like, I just started, but I'm already enjoying it. So yeah. it's, it's <laughs> Big enough to keep Sauri Kun and Hoshino Kun out of trouble, I suppose. It's not a murder case, is it? No, no. It's an anti-nuisance ordinance violation. Huh? Oh, you mean... It's a groping case? She's huh? a smart one. This happened two months back. Some good Samaritans at a train station pinned down a groper who was trying to make a getaway. Wouldn't you know it, the culprit was a cop, of all things. Makes you wonder what this world's coming to. Naturally, the press had a field day with it. It was all you saw on the news for a while. That was it? Like, I mean, I guess I didn't need oh, to yeah, sit there. I remember hearing about that. Oh, never mind. We still talking. It was all over the internet. Anything that stops the trains during rush hour makes the news. It was all they talked about. Probably because he was a policeman. The judge is handing down the verdict today, and I don't expect he'll be pleased with it. Every answer he's given has been, I don't recall. Like, that'll do him any good. Stop that man! That man, the groper! Stop him! Stop him! Bro, this look clean. This look like real life. What did I do? Bro. This is the second time I'm on my water. Bro. This man grabbed me on the train. I'm down, bro. put his hand up my skirt. No, you're wrong. You got the wrong guy. Stop struggling, asshole. Let me go. The cops can check Why is he squirming like that? Be here in a second now, so just chill out! Hey, are you filming this? Put that camera away! Do you mind sitting up straight in court, please? Nah, I'd be on the same tip. A bad attitude isn't going to do you any favors. Oh, Saori! Does it even matter? It's over. The verdict has already been decided. Your demeanor still has consequences. The worse things are looking for you, the better an impression you need to make. Leave an impression. Huh. Well, if I were the judge, I'd be happy about having an easy day on the job for once. This is no time to be cynical either. Besides, the judge hasn't. It's decided. Guilty is charged. <laughs> Dang. This also means <laughs> it's almost time for the curtain to fall until the grand finale. What? And so, let's get this show on the road. Mm, mm, mm. 
Well, like I said, we should have a verdict coming down today. We only really needed Sauri Kuhn at the bench, but Hoshino Kuhn insisted on joining her. Truth be told, I still can't tell when he's trying to help or when he's trying to impress her. <laughs> then he'll need to pull out all the stops. Sauri Kuhn's no slouch. Plus, she's got ice in her veins. Speaking of, how'd you end up on the hook for defending an active duty officer? Well, another firm had it on their plate first, actually. Comro PD, they have their go-to guys. The plan was to get a confession, earning the defendant a nice retirement package and a simple case dismissed. You mean, he'd be found innocent? Bottom line, yeah. On the condition he left the force, anyway. Correct. But the plan fell apart when the cop kept insisting he didn't do it, in spite of the evidence stacked against him. So, once Comro PD's lawyers decided to throw in the towel, the case went straight to Sauri Kuhn, who just happened to take the call. Huh. Makes sense. I'm sure they'll be back soon if you wanted to stick around. I would, but I gotta tie up a few loose ends. But let us know if any new requests come in. Restless as always. You ever heard of a vacation, Yagami? <laughs> That's exactly why I turned my hobby into a job. Besides, I like staying busy. <laughs> Fine. You never did listen to your elders. Anyway, I shouldn't keep Kaito-san waiting. Thanks again for looking after Keiko-san. You need to watch out for him. I don't know. But let me go ahead. Let me see something. So we didn't do this last time. Uh, skills. There are some skills I think we can get. Or nothing. All we can do is okay. Never mind. We can do leaf frog. Add the leaf frog over an enemy. Tiger. None of that. Sky dancer air walk. Jump in any direction. Use the sky dancer. Um. Okay. So none of that. So really, I'm just gonna do my hook. I thought we was getting a lot of points. I guess not. I should have did my attack. I don't have enough for that either. So all right. I just wanted to get that. We'll, we'll be working on that too. I'll probably do some like uh, stuff off screen, maybe some side quests and stuff like that. Because I don't really want to just go ahead and do all hey, of that on ready to wreck shop so they can get a little lengthy. <laughs> Not going to be any bottles of beer on the wall. When... Let's get to work. That's what I'm talking about. I was about to say, who's in the back seat? That's Doggy Bone. I'm like, yo, who was sitting back there like that? I forgot that's him. Well, this the dump you brought Keiko-chan to? It is! So could you please just let me go? Not a chance. I'm tired you of hearing his front voice. You get seat for when your boss shows up. What are you, crazy? He'd murder me on the spot! Then he'd murder you two for dessert! Huh. He's that scary, huh? Yes, actually. Not to mention all his boys. All the more reason to put him in his place. Pricks like that need to learn how to treat a lady. Agreed. Oh, hold on. Oh, bro, I thought it was like my phone phone. Like this. Sugiura. <laughs> my controller started really? vibrating. Oh, I'm not used to it. Worst fucking time. Hey there. You miss me? Jeez, it's been what? Half a year? Everything good over there? Good as it oh, gets. Oh yeah. Well. Got some good news of my own I wanted to give you, Tsukumo Kun and I have I our very own detective agency. Wait, are you saying you started a detective agency? Meaning, now you're a detective? Yep, got our own office and everything. It's in Yokohama. Didn't want to muscle in on your turf. Man, I don't know what to say. Oh, and by Tsukumo, you mean... The one and only. At least, the only one I know. Thought attacking might give us an edge. Well, I feel like I just played this game, but I played this game. Never like, figured he and I were on the same wavelength about stuff. Years ago, I want to wrap this up, talk. But like now, it's anyway, back to me like we got I a just pretty big And to be honest, we're Sorry, in a man. little over our heads. So that got me thinking: why don't we call up the pros so they can show us how it's done? Uh, do you need an answer right away? We're in the middle of the usual. Oh yeah, more sneaky shit. Yep, I'll tell you all about it later. Oh, yeah, that whole, whoa, 
walking in the snow. Hit. Sorry, buddy. Ma. Ma. That's, that, that's all that I needed, roll. bro. That just added so much more to this game, bro. Ma. Ma. Let me stop. Let me stop doing this. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh my! It's by, like we already. We we not even what. We just over a little over an hour in this game, and this is what's happening already. They not playing. Kosuke, care to explain what the fuck's going on? It's uh, not what you think. We're here on account of a woman named Keiko Hamada. She says she's been threatened by an illegitimate business. Oh, I see. You're the guy who. Bro, we just beat Doggy Bone fun. down. Yagami Detective back. Agency, at your service. Yagami Detective? Yo, wait a sec. You the kid Matsugane-san took in? There, you see? <laughs> I told you people have heard of us. Hmm. Bro, Kaito is fine. As for me, the name's Kaito. Used to wear the Matsugane myself. <laughs> oh, I've heard plenty about you. You're a real celebrity, buddy. <laughs> I hope we get to use Some Kaito. has got to have a reputation, right? That would be fine. Masaharu Kaito. Ugly as an ape and just as dumb. Let's an amateur thief get the drop on him, then forks over the family safe. <laughs> yeah. Now yeah, you're a real legend. Don't talk like you were there, jackass. You want an ape? I'm about to go ape shit here. Come on. Fuck it. We're here to get Keiko-san's money, and we'll be tacking on our fee on top of that. Just business. I'm sure you understand. <laughs> Hear that, boys? The detectives come to collect. You know the best part of breaking ranks with the Tojo clan? The freedom. No more paying cuts to guys upstairs. Y'all about to get tough. smacked up. Y'all see all these I chairs in here? I spent the cash on. About to be a no-holes bar. This is damn good soundproofing. Meaning whatever goes on inside, stays inside. You'll find out just how convenient that is. You hear that, Kaito-san? He says we're free to cut loose. Oh, yeah. Best news now, I've heard all day. What they should I'm do gonna open up a is allow me. I'm getting a phone call right now. Hey, uh, hold that thought a minute. Yeah, you different. What they should do is let me switch characters Greetings, and Mr. Yagami Fighting. Did that Sugiura would be different. Call you a second ago? He did, but look, Sukumo, now's really not a good time. Oh, so you really are just busy? He said you hung up on him, so I wanted to make sure. He didn't offend you, did he? I hate to think he upset you, you know? But if so, we didn't mean it. On behalf of both of us, I offer my profuse apologies. Yep, no offense taken, man. But you see my point, right? Sugiura, she and I are a team. Our he really sit here and let me do this? Other. Any responsible member of a company. I mean, any responsible member of society. It's, it's a matter of respect. Okay, I get the picture. We'll continue this later. Okay, but when is later? Should I call you back? If you have an estimate, I can set a timer. Bro, that way I'll know what it's convenient. I was going to say, I would have hung up on him by now. Right. Uh, where do we leave off? I'm tired. You now. gotta be shit. Late talk. That's it. You jokers are dead meat! Okay, so we're gonna go for him last. We're gonna do a... Enhance your playstyle. Improve your arsenal by you start by deposit me. So now, okay, we already did that. Actually, I changed my own. Um, Walk up on me. You know who I am? Oh my god! Why am I getting hit right now? Well, that's what I'm saying. Don't give me no Do not give me no weapons. Get out of my face, boy. Do not give me any weapons. Come here. Sit down. Oh, I wanted to finish him with the kick down. That would have been smooth, bro. We're gonna get it. We're gonna get it one of these times.
I'm mad. Loki took some damage. I wouldn't try to. Every time I do that. Ugh. My fault, y'all. I'm tired. I, Listen, I just no, wanted to thank the both of you for all you've done. We still yeah, making this content, I'm just though. Glad to hear they got your money back. Hey, that music it's or something, huh? Oh yes. I don't know how I could possibly repay them. Oh, don't worry about it. Besides, those thugs paid our service fee and then some. <laughs> nice of them to eat the cost, huh? Beg your pardon. Hey. Oh, uh, okay. Nothing. That was a quick I fight. I take though. it all back. Anyway, what happened to the crooks? If they're smart, they're skipping town. Doubt they'd reopen after how bad we wrecked the place. As for Kosuke, I made sure to tip his college off about his little side business. Should help him rethink his life choices. So I'd say this case is closed. Well, I've sure learned my lesson. It's a scary world out there. Oh yeah? Mm hmm From now on, I choose the place when meeting boys online. And I should probably change dating apps while I'm at it. You should probably just That's not your use big takeaway. Just go find you a man. Really? Kick and chunk. Well, you're laying this all on the app. Okay. Not the Let the man you find you. Just for the ladies. Oh, I don't think so at all. Uh, Plenty uh, of people these days meet their match online. Let him find it's you. It's true, Kaito-san. Apparently, right. that's a thing now. You see, if you don't seize the opportunity when it knocks, it won't be just the times that leave you behind. I'm not gonna lie, this music though. Hear you loud and clear. Got some heat. Sari san and Hoshino can sure are taking their sweet time. Now that you mention it, they should have left the courtroom a while ago. Maybe they stopped for a quickie somewhere. There's He's nothing tripping. Those no, two. no. Nothing <laughs> real, anyway. These old eyes can tell that much. Wisdom comes with age, huh? Damn right it does. And I've got more than you kids on both counts. You talking about Matsugane-san? Yep. The lawyer and the Yakuza. Best of both worlds. Though we came from different backgrounds, we were brothers in arms. Both trying to make it in Kamuracho. You two ought to visit his grave every now and again. We will. That goes without saying. Well, I guess we should get going. I guess so. Thanks for having us on such short notice. Oh, and give the two lovebirds our regards. All rise. I forgot how story-driven this game is. Though. Like, that's just how the Yakuza games are. You hear your moment of fighting, but it's like, dang, after a while, you be sitting here for a minute. Got some good info, though. I'm not, I'm not mad about it. At least not right now. I am getting tired, though. The court is prepared to issue its verdict. The sentence for the defendant, Akihiro Ihara, is six months of penal servitude. He's getting prison time for his first offense? Isn't it usually just probation in cases like this? Yes. I'm sure his attitude didn't help the situation. From the start, the evidence was stacked against him, and all he did was deny it. If that will be all, we can proceed with the court's rationale. The defendant may be seated. Is he tripping? Hmm? Oh, no. You'd rather hear this standing up? Your Honor, in a warehouse, about three days ago, a body turned up in Yokohama. Oh, maybe you hadn't heard that. What? What the hell? What is he talking bro, about? No, no, I don't no, know. no, 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 no. <laughs> What's happening, bro? I'll take that as a no. In that case, Make sure you pass this along to the Kanagawa police. They'll want oh, to know yeah. that the body belongs to a guy named Hiro Mikoshiba. Four years ago, this man took my son from me by driving him to commit suicide. He deserved to die a thousand times, but he was never even accused of a crime. No, he just went on with his life. 
The law let him walk. An utterly broken system. Okay, now we talking. The defendant talk shall refrain talk. from making such outbursts. Defense, do you have an explanation for the meaning of this? Uh, your honor, we, uh... Sorry, you like Ah, she don't know what to say. I can't believe this. Day's work. I just want to go put my feet up in the office. Sounds like a plan. I need to get back to Sugira, too. He was telling us about a big job. You mean a big job for us? Yeah, down in Yokohama. By the way, Sugira and Sukumo, they're detectives now. Those two detectives? A <laughs> good one, Todd. Wait, you serious? Uh, Scheme's absolutely dying to eat your money. Yeah, what a fuck! I'm beyond pissed. I need to unload right, on someone's so face. Huh? <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. Why don't we go give some asshole a game over? You know I'm always down. Yeah, come this way. Come, come throw down. Oh, you got a C for it. Okay, never mind. If you're on certain conditions during a fight, you may earn battle points and net additional SP. Okay. Oh, well, I'm, I'm tripping, but I do want to go fight. Wait, right, where am I supposed to go? All the way over here. Wait, can I go this way? Why would I want to tap R2 then? That's stupid. They should have just let me hold it down. I'm not doing that. These controllers already be sensitive, mad sensitive as is. Come on, let's go fight them. I was just playing. They actually put me in a fight. That was low key fast. It's kind of hard to stop the air combo. And I'm not, I'm not looking at you. Oh my god. No, I did not mean to do that. I don't know what I thought I was about to do, but that's not what I was thinking. That's stupid. This is the Yagami Detective Agency. I run the place with the help of my partner, an ex Yakuza named Kaito. I wish I could say keeping this place afloat was smooth sailing. But the reality is, we'd be drowning if it weren't for the gigs we get from Genda Sensei. It's not like we don't have the technology. I got one of those. But when street smarts fail, most of the time we have to get physical. That happens a lot. You already know. We don't have no time. We saving everything. All right. Guess we can finally take a breather. I was, wasn't I? Crazy how he ended up in our line of work. After seeing us in action, who could blame? Bro, my money is going up stupid slow. Like I'm probably. Yeah, yeah. I don't even sorry, think there are any types of games, but you were saying something about a big case. It, oh yeah. Listen, you gotta come check out Yokohama. We've been getting jobs left and right down here. And if we can ace this case I've got lined up, we'll be the hottest detectives in town. Oh yeah? You sure it's a legit lead? Hey, have some faith. Would I waste your time on a bad lead? Just looking out for you, man. <laughs> Well, I do appreciate that. Then, should I save the details for when I see you? Sure. When do you want us over? Honestly, ASAP. Tomorrow, if you can swing it. We're based in Ijincho. Look for an office that says Yokohama 99 out front. That's us. The real question is, you free on such short notice? Uh, let me check my Sorry, schedule. We didn't say nothing. 
What schedule? Outside of today's shit, we haven't had work in weeks. If I tell them that, they'll lowball our cut, smart guy. Oh, right. And guess we don't want to look desperate. Uh, sorry, Sugira. Yeah, tomorrow works just fine. Perfect. Man, this is gonna be so great. Oh, and Kaito-san's coming too, right? He'll be there. See you guys soon, man. Oh my god, bro. I don't know how long I'm gonna make Sugiura it. said he'd give us the details when we get there. Hit me. <laughs> Way to build the suspense. Yokohama, though. Can't say I'm really familiar with that neck of the woods. Same here. But you know what? Kamurocho has been pretty tame lately. Maybe this is our chance to broaden our horizons. Yeah, everything, the graphics just look... I know you told your friend you're not okay And tell me what's wrong and why you never said you felt that way And guess you're trying to stay strong and fake a smile until I look away But I've known you too long, it hurts to watch your blue eyes fade to grey As you fade away, yeah, 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 yeah. As you fade away Yeah, I'm about to fade away Cause every time I wake up I feel like it's Monday so I'm not gonna lie, I'm not trying to see, I'm not trying to see all this though I love y'all, but I'm not about to do that The Black Sheep Oh, so that was just a mad long like tutorial. Like that was just the the beginning. Yokohama 99's cross streets. Oh, it's not even close to Chinatown. So much for us getting a decent meal on this trip, huh? Well, then how about on the way home we take ourselves a little detour? Maybe. Sukumo's place is way out there. Want to take a taxi? Well, I suppose we could. But why don't we hoof it? Yeah, we could see the sights. I guess I'm on board with that. I meant to say tough. That's tough. Like I don't I don't appreciate that. I feel better though. Like let me see, am I spending some? So yeah, all, okay, all I gotta do is press it once. I thought I had to keep tapping. I was gonna be mad with that too. But yeah, like Yo. I'm saying like we Hold have we have little time. fights. They don't they don't last that long and Nonsense they have like over there. mad long dialogue that is Where'd you call me? So, what the? I don't know. Sometimes hey, it'd be annoying. what are you filming me for? Knock it off. Fight, Chill out, man. Why do you this care? Story is not I don't see anything that says I can't record here. Enough. Right now, Stop. Just real give bad. me a reason. I think it's, it's going to give me more than most It's a free stories. country, isn't it? I'm not going to lie. Most games I just don't be paying attention to this story. What gives? Yeah, you just kicked my side over. Yeah, that was the win, like, man. A big old gust just came through. Right? Like, yeah, crazy. You know just now it swooshed right story, over. So you gonna beat the game I told you! Put that down! Come on! <laughs> but you're supposed to get the story Kids don't seem to give any game, fucks about people these don't. days. Besides, I'm, just, I'm here to play a game. I'm not trying well, to watch a movie. You're thinking what I'm thinking, aren't you? What <laughs> all the games are now. Like, Do you have to ask? <laughs> so, anything else you want to accuse us of? 
I'd say you must be losing it, Pop. You goddamn brats! I got that one. He called us goddamn brats. You picking on high schoolers, man? Uh, no. I just don't want you loitering in front of my store. That's all I said, okay? Why does it look like so that? So stop disturbing my customers. <laughs> that part's not gonna make the video. Wow, is that one of those new smartphone models? May I? What the hell? Damn, the camera on this thing is amazing, man. Your parents buy it for you? No! Oh, crap, he kicked Sophie down. You must be saying things, kid. Anyway, your smartphone's kind of dirty, don't you think? <clears throat> Let me see. Hey! Yeah, he's Give me smacking. my phone back! <laughs> I'll give it back, but only if you put this poor restaurant owner's sign back up first. Who was thinking they can fight? Kick your ass! What is going on over here? I got a whole nother fighting stance now? What? You're not, do You're not doing that. Perry, hold on. Let me set up now. Hold on. Let me, let me, let y'all know. I'm, oh my goodness. Oh, my Perry getting crazy. Hold on. Oh my goodness. I might be. Oh, I might be really different. Hmm. Oh, I can see. Yeah, that. But that's the thing. Can I not parry on the other stances? That's the question. That stinks like a. I'm, I'm, I These like that. I'm, I might actually be trying to parry stuff now, though. I'm be like, whoa! <laughs> Was that Aikido just now? Oh, don't tell me you've been training at a secret dojo or something. Uh, just more of my own thing, really. Figured I'd find a way to hold back for punks like them. Here, this came from one of those kids. Your call what to do with it. <sighs> you really didn't have to, but thank you. Bro, uh, you low-key sound ungrateful. Those were students from Serio High. <sighs> You'd think private school kids would be better behaved, but they're just as immature. They look like a bunch of entitled brats. <laughs> They'd learn some manners the hard way in Kamrocho. Well, we've got our fair share of unsavory types. The Yakuza, not to mention those Yokohama Leomong gangsters. And those kids wouldn't dare to mess with them. So they're selective about their targets. Yes. They'll only harass you if they think they'll get away with it. Think they'll be back for more? I certainly hope not. But anyway, I sure am glad you stopped by. Come to think of it, you're the only ones who've ever intervened. I take it you're not from around here? Yeah, but we might end up staying. For a while, at least. Ever hear of a detective agency called Yokohama 99? We were on our way there right now. Hmm. I'm afraid that doesn't ring a bell. That's all right. If anything, we should get going. Sure. Oh, but before that, please take this with you. It better be something Consider it a too. token of my... Yes, sir. The wristbands. I don't even need to peep all that. Like, I mean, it, it sounds simple. Put it on, too. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna try to make it long. Let's try to let me know that y'all want longer game, yeah, but let's try to get up between oh, 40. Not too shabby, minutes. guys. You know, maybe less than that, depending on what's going on. Ooh. Plus, it just, like I said, this dialogue, bro, this don't be taking like five minutes per conversation. Yo. Oh, we want it with the homies, though. Ah, homies the over. The end of the hour. Gentlemen, welcome. How are you? <laughs> this guy. First, he falls off the radar. Now he's got this sweet office. Okay. <laughs> nah, he's just doing too much. He ain't have to run away with it. Why is he stunning on him like that? You're still quick as a thief. 
Maybe a little quicker, actually. Well, I'd say beef isn't very fair. It was stealing. Oh, come on. You know I wasn't doing it to line my own pockets, right? We took from the powerful and gave to the powerless. It was altruism. And it's all in the past now, so let's just leave it at that. The place is nice, though. It's kind of familiar, even. It should be. You're our inspiration, Yagami Detective Agency. You guys are the goal. Huh. For sure. So, how about you guys take a load off? If you're ready, I'll give you guys the briefing. Say what? A briefing, man? Let him go over what we know. I've actually got an agenda for today's meeting, too. An agenda? Just roll with it. Give him a chance. All the detective talk has made him go a little overboard. I'm sure it'll work itself out. <laughs> it's all good. Imitation really is the sincerest form of flattery. How long was that? Three to minutes? sum up why we called you, we've been seeing a major upward trend with these kinds of cases. What do you think? Care to take a wild guess? I'll give you a hint. It's not a problem you'd find in Kamurocho. So, it's specific to Yokohama? I know. It's gang warfare. The outfits run in Chinatown or at each other's throats, and you guys sort out the aftermath. Well, we did just hear about the Yokohama Ryuma. They're a gang, right? Yeah, the uh, Yokohama Liu, whatever. But they're stirring up shit as we speak. Actually, we haven't run into any gang-related activity at all. No, what we're dealing with isn't so conspicuous. I'll just tell you, it's bullying. Bully. What? Sometimes parents ask us for evidence to prove their child was bullied. Fairly often, they want these bullies taken to court immediately. They'll also want to hold the schools accountable, but none of that happens without solid proof. How old are these kids? Most of them are in middle school. Research shows that boys at that age experience a sudden spike in testosterone. This leads to outbursts to assert dominance, compounded by the irrationality of an immature brain. Scientifically, this potent mix of impulses often manifests as bullying. Yeah, I call that puberty. But that would apply right. specifically <laughs> to boys, right? You're getting cases with girls involved too, aren't you? Ah, with girls, it's more likely rooted in oxytocin, a brain hormone that also has links to bullying. See. Oxytocin fosters feelings of attachment, yeah, he's going overboard, regardless of your gender. For instance, scientists have observed that a mother's oxytocin levels surge when looking at her child. And then it's not always a bad thing, is what you're saying. Indeed. Did you know it was oxytocin that enabled cooperation among our primitive ancestors? Ancient matriarchs were particularly vulnerable during childbirth thus requiring communal support. So you could kind of say the survival and reproduction of our species was largely oxytocin at work. After all, raising a child in the wilderness would have been impossible alone. However, this intense social need bore a dark side. Individuals who failed to contribute were shunned and eventually condemned. Let's say there was a villager who never put in his fair share. All he did was eat the crops. If that became the norm, Nobody would work until the village was on the brink of starvation. And by then, it'd be too late. Precisely. That's why these offenders were punished. Primitive as it was, punishment equated to justice. A necessary measure for society's greater good. And societies with a stricter sense of justice were the ones who endured in the long run. Put so this from into a science perspective, modern oh, day bullying no. is primitive. Okay, I'm done. More like it's hardwired into our nature. Hormones are fucked up, huh? huh. Chalk it up to just that. However, we humans do tend to reject what's foreign to us. Whether we're socially awkward or simply misunderstood, those who don't conform are ostracized. That's how it's been since time immemorial. The misfits of civilization are deserving of punishment. All over the world, no matter where or when. Looks like you guys have been doing your homework. Tsukumo-kun's the one hitting the books. I'm more in charge of the field work. Makes sense. Here's another fun fact while we're at it. An act of betrayal hey, also increases the human urge lit. to punish the offender. I need one of those. In those cases, the oh, act of punishment like, floods the brain with dopamine, triggering an instant rush of pleasure. 
In other words, serving can feel just as good as eating or having sex. I don't know about that. Sure. But that's where we have to draw the line. Justice can't be twisted into joy, or it stops serving its purpose. Facts. Very perceptive, Yagamishi. So, back to reality. What's this big case that needs all the manpower? Ah, yes. Our client is the chairman of a private school. He wants us to scour the campus for any and all instances of bullying, leaving no stone unturned. That said, he also requires us to be discreet. How big is this school? Uh, let's see, there are six classes per grade, making 18 in total, so approximately 600 students. Given that, Sugiyoroshi and I couldn't possibly that's, bet them alone. That's way more we'll be meeting the chairman at a restaurant tonight to lay out the specifics. Have max, like, the How about the two school, of you like come join us? 20. We could use the help. Something stupid. We went from <laughs> pre-K to 12. For a couple of rookies, you sure. You guys are free until dinner. Oh, we already made the reservations in Chinatown, by the way. Think of it, the restaurant's name is Kyoinho. If you could meet us there, that'd be great. Sure. We didn't have to do that. All right. Yeah, they, they be making these boys long and drawn out, but I'm cool. Like I said, this, hey. But I, I'm not gonna do much more. Oh. Kyoinho. Looks like this is it. Are you almost here, Yagamishi? We went ahead and sat down. Actually, we're right. Excellent. Just give the host my name. Will do. <laughs> Was this the same guy living in a net cafe not too long ago? He sure has come a long way. Yeah, at this rate, he'll leave us in the dust. All right, on that note, I'm not touching nothing else. I wanted to say thank you all for watching. Thank you all for being here once again. Anointed Gang, we here. If y'all are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, hit the like button. It really helps me out. Let's get another 10 to 15 likes. And don't forget to throw the comments down. If I'm missing something or when I do miss something or just even going ahead and exploring more, let me know. And also let me know what other game you want me to play. Or if you want to hit me up, I can play some 2K with y'all or play some other games with y'all. So thank y'all again for being here. Love y'all. And take care.